Hey guys, it's your girl Mariela and today's video is going to be a tutorial, yes! And the reason I wanted to do this is because I picked up this really gorgeous eyeshadow quad. I wanted to do a tutorial for the fall and I just thought what perfect colors are these. The greens, the blues, the navy blues, the lavenders, I mean they're just gorgeous. I got this on Harmons or Face Values and the price is here $6.79. The name of this palette, it's a limited edition from for the Project Runway show. And this one is 616 The Mystic Gaze. And I just fell in love with, especially out of all of them, this green teal color. It's just so pretty. Like, I can't even deal with this color. I just, I love this so, so, so much. If you guys want to see how I came up with this look, stay tuned. First, I'm going to start with my Maybelline 24 Hour Tattoo, and this one is in 052 Cool. And I'm going to put this all over my lid, just so the colors can stand a lot better. And I'm going to put this as the base. And first, we're going to start with this gorgeous teal green color. And I'm actually going to use the applicator that came with, and I'm going to put this all over my lid. And I'm going to pass just a little bit above my crease. I'm going to use this shimmery lavender purplish eyeshadow. And I'm going to put this on my crease. I'm going to use this pencil brush. And I'm going to use also the same lavender color. And put it on my lower lash line. Out of all these four colors, I really don't like this matte indigo blue color just because I have tried these eyeshadows and I didn't really like the consistency. It just felt like it was very washy-washy and it didn't do a lot of justice to the color, so I'm not going to use this color. So using this e.l.f. eyeshadow C brush, I'm going to move along onto this really dark navy blue color. I'm going to focus this on my outer V. And then I'm going to go back again with the same brush and I'm going to just focus on the crease line. I'm going to use a fluffy brush and really blend everything out upwards. Now because the intensity is not as much as I would have wanted to, I'm going to go back again and make it really, really dark. fluffy brush and blend everything upwards. Now with the same uh, point brush, I'm gonna use the same navy blue color and the same way I started my outer V, I'm gonna bring it on my lower lash line because I want to smoke it out a little bit more. And I'm only gonna do this halfway just because I still want the lavender uh, purple color to really stand out. Just connect it, your outer V, onto your lower lash line. Now using a flat brush and my Naked 2 palette, I'm going to use Foxy, which is a really like matte eyeshadow. And this is going to go on my brow bone. Just because the eyeshadows are already very shimmery, I just don't want to look like a disco ball with my eyes. And I'm going to bring it inwards too. Okay, so that's pretty much done. With the eyeshadows, on to the next would be curling my lashes. Using my Mally Black Eyeliner, and this one is in Midnight. And I'm gonna line my waterline. And also my tight line. I'm going to use my e.l.f. Liquid Eyeliner in Black. You guys know that I love this. And I'm going to flick a uh, cat eye. Now if you really want, you can connect it also on your waterline, which I think I'm going to do that just to make it a more, more smoky eye look. For mascara, I'm going to use my Rimmel Glam Eyes Day Tonight. And this comes in two steps. So step one is to pretty much separate your lashes. And step two is to volumize your lashes. Step two. And while I'm at it, I'm also going to do my lower lashes. And I'm only going to use step one. 
In the meantime, I'm going to use some falsies and these are by Ardell. They are 102 Demi. Using my Revlon Lash Clue. I really like to first do my mascara first because I feel like the mascara is it's almost like a little bit for the lashes so they can lay there and they're not gonna go anywhere. Just gonna use one of my eyeshadow brushes and use this end right here and push the lashes if you still see like the glue obviously you can always go back with your liquid eyeliner and just draw on top of it just to cover any glue with the same flat brush i'm gonna go back again with my naked two palette and use half baked just so i can brighten the inner corner area Pretty much finished and I did most of my face. I used my L'Oreal True Match and W7. Then I used my Mali Concealer. You guys know I'm a fan of this. My H Rebel and Tan. And for my cheeks, I use the same palette that I have used over and over again in all my tutorials. And this is from the Mali More Perfect Palette. It's called Romantic. It's a very peachy color. And so for my lips, I'm going to use another Mali product. And this one, it's called Mod Pink. A beautiful, beautiful colored. And what I like about this is, is your primer, your high shine lip gloss, and your lipstick at the same time. So that pretty much ends up my tutorial. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys liked and enjoyed this tutorial. Really wanted to use these eyeshadows, a drugstore product, and you guys can find it in any of your near drugstores or where you live. Thumbs up if you like this video and if you want more tutorials. And I will see you on the next video. Besitos. Bye.